Hello and welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. I'm Wicked from Honey Bunny Games and I think I fixed the screw up that happened two episodes back. So, uh, yeah, I think this is fixed. I'm just gonna give it a tiny little test right now. So, I'm just gonna place these bananas. I'm gonna move away and test this thing out. Come on, pick it up. Go upwards, place it down. Okay, come on, come on, go up, go up. And I think this guy should be deleted. Gonna delete it like this. And now, come on, seriously, what's going on with the stairs? And gonna try to pick it up. Okay, that's a bit flimsy, but okay, if it works. I actually redesigned this arm a tiny bit, as you can see, but I think everything else uh, is on spot, like uh, the rotations, the, the size, and all that kind of stuff here. Okay, you can retract, you can go to hell, don't want you to cause any problems again. And as soon as this guy retracts, I'm going to, well, uh, remove these guys. And come on. Come on, come on, come on. Almost. Almost. There we go. Okay, all well, this is resetting. I'm gonna do the logic. Okay, uh, I do remember how it goes, but to be honest, I'm kind of scared everything doesn't go to hell again. So, yeah, let's uh, let's go. This guy is basically the activator for everything. He's our main little guy. So I'm gonna make this area here, which is gonna be not made of the danger blocks, as Twist calls them. It's gonna be made out of the metal blocks. And let's see. Let's see. Okay, so this guy will activate a bearing on this thing. I place it like this. Um, activate the bearing. No, no, no. Wait. How was it? We had a sensor here. Another sensor. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, okay, I'm gonna not need the pipes for some time. So I'm gonna also need the controller. And, well, then this guy. I'm gonna do it a bit differently. See how that works out. Okay. Obviously, uh, this thing falls down, but that's because we didn't connect it to anything. There we go. Um, now this will go minus, uh, minus, minus something. So let's go with minus 30. Minus 25. Minus 20. Seriously? Minus 15? See? Wow. Minus 14? No. Okay, 15 and 14, that's the... Okay. Once it's activated, go... Uh, no, 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 go minus 15. Wait, what? Now go plus 15? Yeah, go plus 15. Okay! Okay, so this guy will activate um, uh, activate this sensor, then I'm gonna have the buffer, which will be connected to another controller, which will be the reset thing. And then I'm going to have the second guy that will actually act as a set button, which will be connected to the first connector. No, 
No, no, no, no. It should be connected to the another connector. Come on, what the hell are you? It should be connected to this guy. What should do? What did it do? Okay, so this sensor will activate the second guy to stay at plus fifteen. So let's see how that works out. Play some bananas. Yeah, I'm a derp. Um, oh shit, seriously? Let's see. And when this thing... Whoa, that's causing a bit of a lag. This thing is removed. It should stay on. I think it is. That, that's perfect. That is perfect. We have what we need. Okay, so this thing is on all the way. This this will be basically uh, this crane. He will shut down when, 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 when. Okay, by the way, you will go like minus 30. I want to be safe. You will deactivate as soon as the crate hits this sensor. So let me try that out. I'm going to place a Great. And this thing should deactivate. Yep, now when it's removed. There we go. That that's perfect. That is perfect. Okay, so we have this guy fixed. The only thing left to do is actually connect um this sensor right here to this to controllers. Then we have to move this guy. How are we gonna do that? I think I talked about that in the last episode, but to be honest, I forgot. So let me see. Um, once the, this guy is up and the crate is here, I could go with the sensor here to detect a crate. But the thing is, yeah, he's detecting this guy. That's that's not good. I could go. I could go with, huh? Can I actually place a block here? Shit, I can't. Uh, no, a block, not... Yeah, I cannot. I cannot. Okay. Let's see, let's see. I could... Oh my god, that would be... No, that wouldn't be awesome because... Yeah. Ah. Okay. Um. Huh, let me see, let me see, let me see. Where do I want the, want the sensor to activate uh, the, the crane? Where do I want it? Where do I want it? Um. Hmm. I could actually go with the idea I had just a second ago. Place it here. Oopsie. Place it here. And when he deactivates, he will activate the this thing. So basically, uh not gate inverter and yeah that, that's exactly what i'm gonna do i'm gonna add another layer of this logical guys i'm gonna separate it uh, like this because i want to keep things organized as much as i can okay so he will activate uh, this little fella which will be to have a sensor Come on. Uh, he should be deactivated just like it is. No, yeah, he should be deactivated. Uh, then I'm gonna have the the moving thing, the controller. I'm gonna have a safety here and something like this. Okay, this is his normal state. That is perfect, and. When he's activated, he will move minus 15. Let's go with 30, minus 30. Okay. Now when this guy opens up. Okay, so this sensor will activate this guy. Then this will happen. Yep, and... Is that maybe a bit too fast? 
I think that could be too fast. Uh, let me let me try it out actually. Okay, so basically revert everything to this point. Now let's start again. As soon as I hear this guy, I'm gonna flip the switch. Did you ever drop the the? Did you drop it? Should have. Okay, I'm gonna have a different point of view and try it again. Okay, go up. You drop the box. You actually. What? No, no, no. Okay, reset the whole thing. Reset the whole thing. Not, it's uh, messed up because this guy has like all the way here and this guy has less so timing is kind of messed up but if we start now everything should be fine so as soon as this guy straightens out I'm gonna activate the crane and if there are no collisions this is perfect come on get out get out get out come on come on no no not good. Not good. Oh boy, not good. Not good, not good, not good. Um, not good at all. Okay, what else could we do? What else could we do? We could have a sensor like looking for upward right here. Um, yeah, that could be. That could be the solution. I think he will activate a second later than the than this guy up here. No, he'll activate sooner. Oh, okay, that that's bad. Maybe I'll just have to use a timer. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I'm stupid. I could simply do something like this just move this further away and it's gonna have to wait for this cycle this cycle this cycle and then move this guy so let me try it out now a uh, complete reset okay go down go down come on thank you no actually I'm gonna wait all the way and you know what, I'm gonna test this thing in another episode. But right now, uh, we're kinda starting to implement the logic into our factory, so everything is automatized. And maybe I'll have like one general switch, which will be the conveyors. Um, but yeah, I think this will be it for this episode, so thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, leave a comment, like the video, and see you next time.